Right now, I'm in my training bag. I'm going hard, I'm getting stronger, I'm losing fat, and I'm glowing up in life. I'm going to share the top four herbs I am currently taking and the scientific reasons I'm taking. So if you want to learn more about how herbs can benefit you, then watch this video. Let's yeah. go. Last year, I fell out of love with health, fell out of love with lifting, and my mind was focused on other things, other bags to say the least. And for that reason, I ballooned up in weight. Luckily now, I've lost that weight, but I'm trying to take my physique now to the next level. I'm training like I'm 22. I'm not, but I know some of you thought I was. Nah, <laughs> uh, it's all good. So the herbs I'm going to mention are herbs that have helped me on my journey and will continue to help me to get to the next level. Watch to the end and I'll give you a bonus herb, a powerful bonus herb and a gift and show you some of the workouts I'm doing powered by these bad boys. So without further ado, let's get into the four herbs. So the first herb I'm taking is technically more of a substance and this is Silagit. And why am I taking Silagit? Well, firstly, Silagit has vulvic acid. It's a good amount of vulvic acid within it. And vulvic acid helps support weight loss by enhancing nutrient absorption. Nutrients is key and reducing cravings, which leads to potential reduction in your calorie intake. So basically, I like food, right? I used to be a chubby kid. You know, so I like food a little bit too much. And some of these herbs can help me be less of a slave to food by reducing potential cravings and reducing potential hunger pains and helping regulate your appetite, thus allowing for a reduction in overconsumption of food. It's not a miracle herb, but this is one of the reasons why I am currently taking it. I say currently because yes, my herb stack changes. I own probably 30 to 40 herbs. So over time, things change. I change my stack for different reasons and because I want slightly different outcomes. The second reason I am taking Syllogy is because, well, I'm always working, right? I'm always up to something and I need to stay sharp, feel good, and I don't take coffee. This herb substance can help with blood flow. Blood flow leads to better stamina, which means you can do more for longer. So that's gym benefits, but also blood flow means good blood flow to the brain, good oxygen delivery to the brain, which helps with staying focused, helps with staying alert and helps with those ideas that come to your mind, helping you to materialize that, helping us get to the back. If you want to know where I get mine, check in the description. The second herb I am taking right now is lion's mane, which technically is a mushroom, a medicinal mushroom or functional mushroom, as some of you might know it. And I'm actually taking this in pill format. If you want to know where I get mine, link in the description also. And lion's mane is said to help boost brain function and I need to stay sharp, as I mentioned before, but also helping to increase or enhance cognition. Right now, I'm working on something big, one of the biggest projects I've ever worked on. And that's why I am taking Lion's Mane. I'm gonna share it soon because it's to do with the community as well. But that's one of the reasons why I'm taking Lion's Mane because I, I need to stay focused. You know, if you're trying to think of things that are innovative, that are big, it requires you to become an innovative person and to be a bigger person. So there's a level up that needs to be done to achieve or bring forth things that are a level up, if that makes sense. You grow as you give. So although I'm using Lion's Mane for its brain boosting benefits, I'm also using it to help stay calm especially in these high stress, these high pressure environments that I'm finding myself in because lion's mane can help reduce anxiety and help support mental health. The third herb I'm using right now is Siberian ginseng and this is different to Panax ginseng which is also powerful and why am I taking Siberian ginseng? For one, it's said to help boost energy. Energy as a whole will be a consistent theme because of its positive spiral. If you have high energy, you become highly effective. If you become highly effective and you tick off things off your to-do list, you feel good about it. You get that dopamine hit, you get that reward, you get that pleasure, which means you want to do more moving forward. So you're an upward spiral of being high performing. And that's why sometimes energy is the foundation and you start feeling good about it. Your confidence is up because you're someone who says you're going to do something and gets it done. There's also positive research that Siberian ginseng can help improve stamina, can help with strength and can help with mental concentration. So generally speaking, this herb is powerful. It's a good adaptogenic herb that helps you return to, to balance after workouts, but also helps reduce stress or cortisol levels within the body. This helps you keep your cool in the gym, get them gains in, but also keep your cool in the boardroom when you need to get them gains in. <laughs> Health is wealth, you know? The fourth herb I am taking right now is cacao. And I tend to add this to my herbal pre-workout waters or some of the waters I take to the gym. And this has serious energy boosting 
and benefits. Also, cacao can help you get a better night's sleep. Although it's not best to have it in the evening because it is still stimulating. It's got something called theobromine, which is like a cousin of cacao that is stimulating and helps boost your energy levels without that crash after. But also it does have a little bit of caffeine within it. So I'll be mindful about taking this in the evening, but it's calming benefits can also be beneficial for sleep just have it early afternoon or have it early evening before you go to the gym so i take this for gym as i said but also if i need an energy boost without coffee then i'm going to go for my cacao and i add it to my teas or add it to my water i remember being at uni before an exam so this is something that's high pressure and requires my focus and i'm operating on minimal sleep i used to have cacao right before and when i went into those exam halls i felt so relaxed I felt energetic, like if I had a good night's sleep. Bearing in mind, I probably slept for like four or five hours a night before. So cacao is powerful for those high concentration environments. And it makes you feel good from what it does for your neurotransmitters within your brain. And it's what chocolate is made from. You feel good after chocolate, then you'll feel great after cacao. So bonus time, and the bonus is green tea. But why this is a bonus, although green tea is powerful, I sometimes replace green tea with something called oolong tea. And oolong tea has less caffeine within it, so it has less caffeine than green tea, but it's beneficial for helping reduce fat levels. So if you need help along your weight loss journey, green tea is good, but oolong tea is also good. Oolong tea can also help with muscle pain muscle pain i'm working out heavy i'm burning and tearing down muscle it's painful what can help with that pain potentially all long tea and it's said to help balance the metabolic rate and recovery from gym so this is beneficial from a lifting standpoint that's a key bonus for that you should drop a like but sometimes i replace my green tea or my all long tea with something called long jing tea we've got long jing tea which will be the basis of a lot of my tea and long jing tea can help boost mental alertness and help boost the blood flow so this helps with my performance in the gym but also my working out in the office so these two herbs are also bonuses but when i do take my green tea i tend to opt for loose leaf green tea which is known as green tea sancha because you know green tea is a show win i want it in its most potent ways less adulterated so i take my loose leaf green tea sancha and this green tea can potentially help with energy appetite regulation and more so gift time, I'm going to give you 40% off my herb course if you use the code DUNGO35 at checkout. Check out my best-selling herb course link in the description. I promise you it's a game changer. Everybody who's used it and taken this course has found some benefits for themselves or their money back. So click the link in the description and join the Fueled by Herbs community. And before you go, check out these four herbs with natural steroid effects for bodybuilding and muscle growth. Guys, let's go.